Hi, this is Jacob. And this is Keely. And we're going to teach you about angles of elevation. And depression. Awesome. Let's go. Okay, so the, ele the angle of elevation is the angle between a horizontal and the line of sight for something above the horizontal. So this is a little guy looking up at a seagull probably. And so like this angle right here between his line of sight and his eye level would be the would be an angle of elevation. And we'll do a problem to show you a little bit better what an angle of elevation is. Okay, so a six foot tall man looks up at a building at an angle of elevation of 23 degrees. The man knows the building to be 1,000 feet tall. How far away is the man from the building? Okay, let's try to visualize this a little bit. Okay, so this is our guy looking up at his building. And so, he is six feet tall. That's six feet. And he's looking up at this building at the very top an angle of 23 degrees. And so this part is also six feet. six feet. And this part, we don't know. Let's call it, let's call it X. And we know the building to be a thousand feet total. And so then we know that um, X plus six is going to equal one thousand. And so we'll, we can solve for x, and x is going to equal nine hundred and ninety-four. And so, now that we know what x equals, we can use our knowledge of tangent and what, how that works to solve for the distance between him and the building. And so we know that tangent equals opposite over adjacent. And so the tangent of 23, 23, sorry that's a 3, degrees is going to equal x over the distance. And so let me just solve for the distance because we know what x is, it's 994, so the distance is going to equal Hundred and ninety four over the tangent of twenty three degrees, and that is going to equal two thousand three hundred. 41.72 feet. So congrats, you just solved your first angles of elevation problem, and now we'll go on angles of depression. Okay, the angle of depression is the angle between the horizontal and line of sight at a downward perspective. So, for example, I could show you a man standing on a building. He has two heads all of a sudden, and he is looking down. So the angle of depression would be this angle right here. So let's do an example. Um, a six foot tall man stands on a building and looks down on a cat 20 feet away at a 70 degree angle of depression. How tall is the building? So let's draw a picture to visualize our problem. So here is our building. Here is our man who is six feet. Um, this is our horizontal. And this is his line of sight, looking down 
at our disfigured tabby cat. And the tabby, we know, is 20 feet away from the building. So what we're trying to figure out is how tall the building is. But before that, let's know that this entire length, we'll call this x. So our building, therefore, would be x minus 6. So we also know that he is looking down at a 70 degree angle of depression. Now that we have these things, we can figure out the height of the building by using Sokotoa. So, first let's try to find x. So figuring for x, we know that we have, we have with respect to the man, an opposite, and we're trying to find our adjacent, which is x, but we also need this missing angle right here It'll be a question mark but you have to realize that we know it because this is a right angle and since all right angles are 90 degrees we know that our missing angle is going to be 20 so let's start doing some trig we are going to figure for the adjacent by using the tangent so we know that the tangent whoops the tangent <clears throat> of 20 degrees <clears throat> will be equal to our opposite over adjacent. So now we can write this as the tangent of 20 degrees is equal to our opposite, which is 20 feet, over adjacent, which is unknown. So we can do the switcheroo, so we get our x to equal the tan, oops, x to equal the 20 over the tangent of 20 degrees. And as we calculate that, we will get x to equal 54.9495 feet. But that's the only the height of our x. The height of the building, as we had shown earlier, is x minus 6. So if we subtract 6 from 54, we will get the building to be a height of 48.9495 feet. And that is our answer for the height of the building. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching! watching. They're going to appear, and now they're gone. <laughs> walk, 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 walk.